Facebook is deleting your live videos, but there's still time to save them. If you've already seen the notification or you're just hearing about this, now is the time to take action. Facebook announced in February of 2025 that live videos will now be automatically deleted after 30 days, and this change is rolling out through the summer of 2025. I posted a video and the response was so huge. So many of you had great questions that needed more explanation. That's why I'm creating this special video series to walk you through exactly how to download and save your Facebook Live videos before they disappear. I'm Maggie Carey. I'm a social media strategist who has helped thousands of entrepreneurs go from, I don't know what to post to I've got this by using simple, easy to follow steps that make a big difference. Now it's showtime, so let's get started. You need to start looking at downloading your videos now. Facebook will be deleting these live videos after 30 days, including those that were posted in the past. While you will get notified when your videos are affected, don't wait. If you've ever gone live for a business, webinar, product demo, anything else, you should download those videos now before they're gone. How do you download Facebook Live videos? From a desktop. Go to your Facebook page or your profile, click on the down arrow on the top right corner, select settings and privacy, and then settings. On the left sidebar, you'll see your Facebook information. Then choose download your information, and here you'll see a variety of content that you can download. You can select live videos from that list and choose a date range, or you can select everything. After selecting the live videos, click create file. Facebook will begin preparing those videos for download. Once the process is complete, you'll get a notification that your download is ready. To access your download, you need to go back into download your information section and click on available downloads. Now, depending on how many videos you have, this may take quite a while to do. Now, download your live videos. When you click download next to your live video files, you may have to enter your password to begin the download. Now, again, depending on how many videos you have, the download may take some time. Be patient and check back periodically. Where are your downloads stored? Well, Here's the thing, after you click download, the files will save to your computer, typically in a downloads folder. From there, you can transfer them to cloud storage like Google or an external hard drive. There are some other services that you can use to transfer your video. Facebook will be giving you some options once you get that notification. I recommend storing your videos in multiple places to avoid losing them. You can use a Google Drive for cloud storage. You can use an external hard drive. That'll give you more space and not block up all the space on your computer. Or you can call your favorite IT person and see if they have a backup system where you can store all of your live videos. Some people are downloading them onto their computer and then uploading them into other social media platforms such as YouTube or LinkedIn. Here's my problem with that. You're going through all this work already to download into Facebook. If you're going to another platform, what if they start implementing this process as well? Now you're back to square one and you have to do this process all over again. As an IT professional, I'm begging you, please get a good backup of your media. Don't rely on somebody else's storage for your content. I've heard that some people are struggling with their video downloads. They're experiencing some issues. So. What if your downloads aren't working or some videos are missing? Here's something you can do. Make sure you selected live video in those download sections. Try a different browser or maybe an incognito window if you're facing issues with downloading. Sometimes clearing the cache or switching to Chrome helps. Check Facebook's help page. If downloads are missing, they may still be processing on Facebook's side. So if you're downloading a large number of videos you may want to consider downloading in batches maybe doing a year at a time it depends on how much video you have so please subscribe ring the bell so you'll get notified and not miss the rest of this Facebook live series and of course check out the master at media YouTube channel for a full 
Facebook Live series playlist to get all the details on how to save, store, and manage your Facebook Live videos.